Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of me playing Ticket. As always, this is Vlad, and today I'm going to swap my terrible arrangement of water mills which I had, because at the moment it's just so bad. So um, I'm going to make it a manual one, instead of an unmanned one, because they produce way more power that way. I haven't done anything, it's still all the same. Uh, so just take this. This here is um, a wrench I just made um, out of the bronze. And it just like lets you pick up all the stuff safely. Oh, what? Are you actually serious? I had to fall down this hole. Oh no! <laughs> no, it's gonna take forever! So I'm going to set it up down in a ravine and I'm just going to hook up the four water mills to a the bat box and then just basically fill them with the water manually using the buckets. I hope I didn't miss any. Okay. Um, and then I, I need some food as well. I'm running out so I think I'll make a canning machine maybe and, and then I don't know whether it still works but you can can the rotten flesh you get and it'll go into like um it'll go into tins and each one will be one food like health thing and also um fill up your health and Apparently it removes the rotten flesh aspect, so like you won't have that hunger poison thing. Okay. Uh, don't need that, but I need this. So let's clear this out. Do I think it did? Trusty dirt. Made a jukebox. We got the um the music disc, which can be played in there. Which is always good because you need music while working. Okay. Um. So I'm gonna place this here. And I got the cables. I think offhand. Oh no. I won't worry about it. Okay. And if I place water meal, water meal, water meal, water meal, and then I have that coming out like this, I can have the macerators or I can do. coming out here and then it'll come out across like that. So it's a bit imposing but hopefully it works. Ah uh, um gonna make another bucket. There we go, bucket. And place this back, get that. Gonna make an infinite water source down here so then I can um place like just put the water in um the water mills whenever I need to. So 
It's raining now. It's just really annoying. Always raining. And I think we can make our pump as well today. So. Yeah, start game. I didn't seem to use that much food, but I've used it all up now that I'm actually doing stuff. Okay. Oh, ham. Whoops. I'll put that there. Although I should have put it like here. Hmm. For the time being, I'll just put it here. Okay. So time consuming now. That's why I want it back a normal one. Oh. I think that's making power now. Yeah, so look how fast that is already. And that's it only like two of them running. So it's just way more effective. Yeah, but it, it really does use up your time. But at least it's a sort of power which is sustainable. So I can actually macerate all my stuff at no cost just time is the cost of this one solar panels and windmills are better except windmills are just a bit fidgety because you need to put them up high for them to be effective and then they will use the E as they go as the power travels down the cable yep see we've already gone past what we had before but the downside is that these are running out of water already. Okay, so that's good. Whoops. Okay, I will then set up macerator here. And I can start to macerate the rest of my copper. And still got power going into it. So, what else? We had the glass. Okay. It's a tank. We, no, hand, we don't have it. Get the mining well, and we get the tank. Put the tank on top of it, and we get a pump. Now. We'll have to make more tanks, so I'll go quick some sand. But I'll the first lava pool I think I'll get rid of is that one just there. Because it's just the closest one. And so I'll make a after I'll actually I might go exploring some some for some sand. I think that's what we'll do. So don't wanna get rid of too much of it from the um from the beach, I suppose you would call it. I um, want to find a desert because if you take it all from the beach, it just looks a bit weird. Okay. So yeah, you guys may have noticed that I have an intro now, which I just made myself. Took about a second. Um, bit fiddly. I I, I used um one of the default pieces of music that I have. Um, on my PC at the moment because I haven't downloaded iTunes yet and put all my iPod songs onto it. But apparently, some people like it, so yeah, it's a bit weird, but it works, I suppose. So, not having much luck. Oh, there we go. In the distance. Oh. Wish I was I was in the desert right now, so it stopped raining. So, I reckon I should add to the game where you like have a heat on your person. And if you get too hot, you get, like heat stroke or something. If you get too cold, like when it's raining or when you're swimming, then you'd like get a cold. That would impact on your food bar or something. 
That'll be interesting, get diseases in the game and stuff. Sugar cane. Some more oil over there, we can pump that out. Rubber. Oh, my God. I don't even know if I'll make it back with any hunger. Or any food. I want to try and cook this stuff. I should really stop sprinting, but don't want to waste too much time. There's the oil geezer over there. Okay, here we go. These cactuses. There's another one over there. Look a bit weird. I have plenty of shovels. So guys, um, there's more oil everywhere. It's like four. Um, I'll come back to you guys once I've collected about three stacks of sand, maybe. Maybe more, maybe less. I don't know. Okay guys, I'm back. I um, collected some sand. I got some cactus. Because I realised that we'll need that for the pipe waterproofing. And um, I'll just mark this on the map. Desert... Oh, I'm going to spell it wrong. Lots of oil. There we go. Colour. Oh. Where's black? How, how would you make black? Oh. Okay, that's good enough. <laughs> okay, um. I officially cannot run now. I used up one already. So, um, one of my friends said to me, like, so how many diamonds you got so far in your LP? And I'm like, oh, I've got a few. I made, I made them into a juke, I made one of them into a jukebox. He's like, why did you do that? You should have got an energy condenser. And so, the thing is, um, energy condensers, basically, if you get the right set up, and you, it's really expensive and all, but in the end, you can get whatever you want. And I will be getting an energy condenser in this series, but I don't really want to, like, get where you get the energy collectors and that gives you, like, whatever you want, like, diamonds and stuff. And, like, I'm not playing this for, like, the ultimate resource. I want to play it to actually gather the stuff. I don't want it to be all done for me. If you know what I mean. Because I just find that's like a... It's, it sort of ruins the game, in a way, if um, you have everything done for you. Part of the reason that Minecraft makes it so fun, or is so fun to me, is gathering the resources and, like, spending some time gathering the resources so when you do build something, it feels like you've actually put some effort into it. But yeah, so, I won't be doing one of those setups with, like, the 18 energy characters and stuff. And all like focusing on like the energy condenser and stuff. Like I have no problem in like changing other stuff into something else, like tungsten or into diamond or or like into diamonds, because tungsten is worth like two diamonds. But um, I just feel that like. Just having all your stuff made for you is a bit of a bit like a waste if you if you get what I mean. So we'll do that. Uh, need my food. So we've got the pump. Need to cook this sand. Oh, is this a machine block? No, it's an iron fence. Iron furnace, electric. Okay, um, so it's just an electric circuit, and that's like that. Okay. Will I? Oh, 
There it goes. No more power. Okay, so I'll make one. Oh, actually, no, I think I can make two. Okay. Find iron, okay. Okay. And iron furnace and redstone. Got an electric furnace, so this stuff doesn't require any coal for it to work. You just need to power it using this stuff. However, because I've got too many things being powered, I'll take this out. Should really be grabbing two buckets instead of one. So they're sort of like blinking. Actually, might be yet. Yeah, okay, they're almost working. Okay, I'll put this in here. Um, that, and then we'll put that in there. And that. So it is time-consuming. This is struggling. <laughs> That's how poor the energy from these this stuff is. Okay, um, so we've got this cactus green. If we put it here, we get pipe waterproof, which pipe waterproofing, I should say. Which, if I get some glass, and I think this is it, or it could be like that. Yeah. Okay. So I'll put that there, get a bunch of this, and then cobblestone transport pipe, I get 64. Okay, I'll put this in like that, and oh, I'll have to go and get some more cactus, because I just turned it all into pipe waterproofing. I get that, and that, cobblestone waterproof pipe, and so that will transport all the liquids. Got a nice amount of um, glass now. I'll have to power it, but um, we're almost there to pumping up our lava. I'm um, off camera. I'll also war work um, on getting more of that cleared out so we can start moving in there. But um, and try and get this stuff cooked without it all dying. Okay, I think that's it guys, um, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.